Hello everybody, it's Blitz Girl here, and I'm going to find a prompt to draw in the queue. His back hair made a perfect sunset. I don't really feel like drawing back hair at the moment. Order clogged sink. Or Mr. Skeletal. Or a piece of delivery. I'm not captioning. Or Luchador. Wow, I'm not feeling any of these. Okay. No. Mm. Wow. This is not a good day for prompts. The pirates make spaghetti. Ah, uh, no. That's a maybe, if I see that one again. Apocalypse if it were a kid's cartoon. Maybe. No. No. Snape on a plane. Okay, let's draw a geometric plane. Yeah, that's the one I'm used to. It's got a few points on it and got, yeah. Okay, so let's work with that, I guess. Since I'm not really feeling most of these for whatever reason. Okay, so we're going to rough out the plane. We're going to, I think we're going to draw Snape on the plane itself. Okay. Here we are now we'll get outlines. Maybe. There we go. Outlines. I like to try and get my outlines pretty close, so it bugs me when they're not right. So, should we draw the movie version of Snape? Because the illustrations in the book, Snape, are significantly different. He has like a goatee and a little mustache going on. Find a good reference. Not seeing a lot of full body Snape images, so. I have to improvise on the rest of that. Let's just stick with this one because it's pretty close. Make that it's normal size. I have Snape on my head. Okay. Is it going to be kind of lying down? <laughs> I have kind of a horizontal thing going here, so maybe it's going to be lying down. It's 
It's going to be like a magic carpet or something for Snape. So he's going to have another arm out like this. And legs. This robe, cloak, whatever, kind of going on there. And wand. Let's see. Kind of, kind of glowing green, I think. Bigger brush, thank you. Maybe I'll put Batman in this little trail of sparks coming from the wand. It's going to be in white. Get the ears. Oops, wrong color. Switch the gray. Okay. White. breaking up there. Okay. And might make his head a little bigger. Let's see, it's kind of a high collar. It's a touch of white. And we need the face. Okay. And one hand here. To get the highlights on the robe. It's clothing. It's one of my weak points because I haven't done a lot of it. How does he hold that? How do you hold that wand? Okay. And all the folds in clothing still tend to get me. I just don't have enough experience with those yet. So I just kind of fake it. People as a whole, I'm not especially strong on. I'm better with animals and natural settings when it comes right down to it. Eyebrows. Eyes, nose, <laughs> maybe I'll be able to tell this is Snape. Okay, so now we need point, we need to make this obviously a plane. OK. 
Okay. I need like a P in the corner. I need point S, point A. All right. Let me get hand. And then maybe here we're going to have castle. Okay. Snape on a plane. Okay, let's see where this is in the game. Oh, panel two. <laughs> okay, this might go in a different direction than the original caption person thought, but I think that's a fair interpretation. It's Snape and he's on a plane. All right, well, thank you guys for watching this Drawception panel, and I'll see you later.